Hello everyone. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to download Android Studio and all the required add-ons components for working on Android. So if you are new to this channel, please subscribe to this channel. Before downloading Android Studio, we need to have JDK installed in our machine. For that, we need to go and type JDK download. And uh, we need to click the first link. And here we'll get the latest uh, JDK. Uh, which is at present uh, for and select your OS operating system from here and click on Windows as of, uh, as of now I'll be clicking on Windows then uh, you need to click the 64 installer uh, let the download get complete then uh, I'll show the installation process as you can see the JDK download has been completed and we can directly double click on it and lesson will start so here we can directly click on next and it is the path where uh, this will be getting installed uh, if uh, i prefer uh, this would be uh, whatever we are getting here uh, we should be going on with that uh, it should be in program file c so once that is completed uh, we can directly close this yeah so to check whether uh, jdk is uh, installed properly uh, or it is uh, showing in your machine or not uh, go to cmd and type here um, java version so here it is 18.0.1.1 what we have downloaded here it is 18.1.1 once you are done with the uh, installation of uh, JDK, uh, we need to set the environment path uh, uh, for uh, the JDK. So for that, you need to go to the C drive and then program files and then uh, search for Java and JDK. Here it is the Java. Then in here, we need to click on bin and uh, we need to copy the path control C. And for uh, editing the environment variable, we need to uh, here search for edit uh, environment variable, edit the system environment variable. Yeah. Uh, click on environment variables. Here we need to path is there, right? Yeah, here path. We need to um, give the path for that. Click on new and give the path of the pin. Click on OK. Click on OK. OK. Also, some application needed uh, Java home variable to be there in the system or environment variable. For that, uh, again, we'll go to C drive, program files, uh, Java, and then JDK. And here, we'll not go to bin folder. We'll directly copy this path. And we'll add that in the environment variable again. Edit the system environment variable, environment variables. And here, we need to create a variable name as Java home and here a uh, variable value will put that uh, path of that okay so here comes to the end of uh, jdk part now we'll go directly to installation of uh, android studio for downloading android studio we'll go android studio download here we'll come to this link developer.android.com slash android studio slash download uh, then we'll directly download android studio uh, here by clicking this one accept it and now we'll wait for a few time to get this download completed as you can see the download of android studio has been completed now we can go directly to the folder and what here we need to do is do not uh, double click directly we need to run this one as administrator so remember when uh, after downloading android studio we need to run this one as uh, administrator okay so once we clicked on that uh, the installation will start Click on next. So here, go with that whatever it is showing. Space required. You need uh, you need to have like a good amount of space for that. 2.7 GB it will take. Yeah. So I'll click on next. This is the path where Android Studio will be getting uh, installed. And then go with that Android Studio install. 
here we can see the details <laughs> See and uh, after this status got uh, it green, uh, it is being completed. We can click directly on next and start Android Studio. Uh, <clears throat> if uh, you are using this uh, for the first time, uh, installing this uh, for the first time in your machine, so you can go with the do not import settings. But uh, if you are already using Android Studio and you have some configuration, if you have some a folder directories anything then you will go to this first uh, option so as of now i'm new to this machine so i'll go directly to this okay as of now i'll do don't send once you come to this uh, click on next go for standard type and these are the themes uh, light and dark uh, i'll choose uh, dark and uh, these are the things uh, SDKs uh, and all other components for uh, your working on an Android things will be getting uh, downloaded first. <clears throat> Total download size, uh, size will be 550 MB. Click on next. These are the things will be getting downloaded and click on next. So accept this uh, policy, user policy, click on. Uh, and click on this one and again accept this and click on finish here it will start downloading first all the SDKs and uh, required things then it will get installed so this will take some time As you can see, it has downloaded and installed all the components uh, that is uh, listed and and it is completed. So we can directly click on finish and we can start the new project from here. Or if you have any existing project, we can directly open that and start, uh, start working on that. That's it guys. Uh, if you have any queries regarding installation, you can directly comment it down. I'll get uh, get through them and I uh, will reply to that. And yeah, thanks everyone for watching.